Did guys chase after a girl? No, hell no. What? My advice to all them young men out there, don't chase after nobody. Focus on yourself, get goals, grind, whether that's your physique, whether that's your career. Focus on yourself and I promise you, someone will come your way. Wait, hold on, hold on. Where's your girlfriend though? I'm too busy. I'm just saying, be on your grind and you can do that shit later, all right? You don't have to try and like, because of FOMO or whatever, to like waste all your time and invest into like a specific individual that might not even take you seriously because it's a sad reality that we live in and I can be generalizing, but I believe that a lot of girls in their early 20s do not want to settle down in their early 20s. So while they want to just date to have fun and break your heart, fuck all that, oh focus on yourself, God. work on yourself, work on your career, <laughs> Like, work on your physique whatever it may be just look in the mirror and just like find ways to better yourself and you know by the time you become the best version of yourself someone will come their way all right boys you listen to him you get no <laughs> bitches trust me bro yeah if you want to get married one day you got to do something mm. obviously explore your options i'm saying while you are working on yourself you don't have to be in a relationship you can just you know be make friends with a lot of different people and just see what kind of personality they have yeah you don't have to date them but just explore your options so that by the time you're in, you know, you're willing to like settle down and you're happy with where you are in life. At that point, you can make, make the best decision you can to find the best girl that is right for you. You don't have to do that shit now, bro. Especially at 19, bro, study, work hard, get a good job. I'm just saying that's a waste of time because I believe that genuinely like girls in their early 20s aren't willing to like get married and have kids. So like, it's just like you're most likely going to be that dude that she had a cup, she had fun with. And I'm saying, and I'm not saying don't have your fun. You can have fun here and there along the way, but I'm just saying don't be too invested into a person where you're willingly chasing after a girl. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Okay, that's oh, a bit dude. too much. Yeah, that's nothing to do with like chasing after a girl or not. All right, then what's chasing? Yeah, like making yeah, plans yeah, and Yeah, shit. making plans. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, that's yeah. not necessarily chasing though. Chasing is more like you're emotionally, physically, or financially just really investing into this individual. Yeah. And I would say that that's chasing. I want to say like just because you made a date to hang out with a certain individual doesn't no, mean that you're necessarily date. chasing. Like several dates. Yeah, several dates. You can go mm -hmm. dates here and there, but I'm just saying, focus on yourself, Kings, and I promise you, someone will come your way. You, know, you don't have to waste all that time trying to find, like, you know, nobody. Like, the, per the right person will come to you. Yeah, he seemed like he never had girls in his early age, but, you know, and he's definitely grown, probably built his own em empire already. Um, but I don't know, for me, I've, I've learned it a little bit too late, you know. Um, I don't regret anything. Um, I'm in my almost to my early 30, on my 30s now. So um, I don't regret anything. Uh, I'm focused on myself. Uh, I mean, obviously I should have done this when I was 20, but it is what it is. Um, but he's right, man. If you guys are young, uh, guys, listen to Andrew Tate, man. He's he's the leader out of this uh, young uh, male generation. So man, like yeah. like like uh, you know those other two dumbasses, right? Just laughing at them, like they're young, like like the dude even called them out, right? Eight at nineteen, you know, what I'm saying like what the fuck, yeah, yeah. Like nineteen, right? Um, so that guy seemed like he's speaking from experience um, to to not chase like uh, a bunch of what he's saying is like like uh, uh, don't be so uh, I think that emotional investment in a person, right? Because yeah, yeah. like that just consumes a lot of your time, right? When you're thinking about them, you know, it, it you, you change the directions um, of how you live your life, right? You change the your decisions on on how you live your life based on the people that you chase, right? Like whether that be friends, certain family members, right? Or or you know, you're trying to pursue uh, a relationship with somebody, right? Um, you you move differently. Right, you operate differently. Your your money, you know, you allocate your money differently, and and you especially yeah. your time differently. You know, so that that time and energy and effort could have been spent on the people who are down for you. You know, um, but because you're pursuing actively pursuing somebody, right, romantically, that's consuming now that energy and time. You know, uh, and and that takes away from your own personal development too. Right, so. That's, that's yeah, and, and, expressing. and the chances of, of her leaving you in your mid 20s is pretty high because she's meeting other girls, uh, other dudes. Um, she wants to explore, she wants to have fun, she wants to have a hot girl summer. Um, eventually, she's gonna want to, you know, find something yeah. and have her fun while she's young and while she's still pretty. Yeah, so 
it is what it is, man. That's just how society is. Because people, people want to find their prince charming or or their Cinderella at like in their early twenties, you know, or in their twenties, you know. And I think like most people don't know what the fuck they want until maybe after thirty, you know. So, so I think, I think um, <laughs> I remember seeing a, a while back, like J Lo said, um, made a comment saying that like guys are useless until maybe after thirty two. <laughs> I was like, man, how true is that, dude? You know, because like guys yeah, yeah. are fucking up, you know, going through emotional changes and 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 trying shit, and until like after thirty, then they kind of get their shit together, you know. So that's true, man. Uh, that's how with uh, with both generations of of women and and guys, but um, obviously these guys are guys are getting worse, girls are getting worse. Um, but the ones who are woke that was willing to work on themselves are the, you know, the low percentage. And same with the girls too. You know, there's a low percentage of women that want to, uh, you know, reserve their body for the right man down the road. And yeah, it's the world's kind of fucked up. But it is what it is, man. It's kind of like, hey, don't don't go, don't watch corn, you know. And you know, you know, what we do anyways. Don't eat fast food. You know what we do anyways? Eat fast food. Yeah. Oh yeah. We know we know what's bad. We all know what's going what's bad for us, but we still end up doing it anyway because of conveniency, uh instant gratification. Um it is what it is. Um but if you are young, if you're nineteen, please work on yourself. If you want any help, anything, me and Peter are on the Discord. Join the Discord because we're there to help you guys and conversate with you guys and not make you guys lonely, okay? We're here to talk here with you guys. Awesome. Um, 